Nerds! Welcome to Nerd Magic. Time to get nerd up. Nerds, it's finally upon us. Time to get your ROM fixed. We got a lot of ROM to install on the LG V20. Just click on the link in the description below. It will send you to this page right here, my friend. And this ROM, the weather ROM, it will work with any version of the LG V20 you have. Doesn't matter if it's AT&T, Verizon, T-Mobile, Sprint, the international version. It doesn't matter. Just go on this page, click in the link in the description below. I'll be installing it on the AT&T LG V20. Follow my steps so you don't get lost, alright? And don't forget to like and subscribe because this is going to be fantastic, guys. And I already got the application installed, so I'm just going to go and go to recovery right now and install this. Alright, so now we're in recovery. Da -da 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 -da. All right, so the very first thing you want to do when you're in recovery, you just want to click on wipe, swipe, make sure you do a factory reset. It's just a best practice. Go advanced wipe. I like to clear the Dalvik cache and the cache right after. I know it's kind of repetitive, but it's just one of my best practice. It doesn't harm the phone in any what way, so I just do it. Now click on install. Then once the ROM is downloaded, just go to the path of wherever the hell you downloaded that ROM. I'm looking for my own right now. I know it's in a download folder somewhere if I can find that shit. Alright, where is it at? Okay, I think I just found it. Download. Alright, uh, Weta. Okay, here it is right here. The Weta US996. Alright. AT&T people, ignore the fact that it says US996. This is one of the perks of having an AT&T LG V20. You can install the US International ROMs as well. Watch and you see what I'm talking about. Okay, so... The GUI generated there, just click on next and look right at the top, it says unlocked US996 or H910. And then we have the Verizon option there as well. The T-Mobile and the Sprint own, you just have to download the different version that is on the link that I left in the description below. Let's continue this installation. I'm just gonna do, uh, let's see, let's just do the flash stock, in, flash stock kernel. Alright, as you can see here, there's a lot of different tweaks right here for audio because this is an audio driven ROM, guys. I'm gonna do the weather audio, let's go wild with it. V4 X High 5 Dolby Atmos, Uncool Music Player. I'm just going crazy right here. Okay, should I do anything else now? Let's skip that. Alright, here's another option. Let's include Super Audio Driver. Hell yeah! <laughs> what do you expect? <laughs> let's click next. Alright, we got the Dolby Atmos right here, the DAP 2.3. I'm gonna select that one. Alright, and there you have all the system UI mods as well. The continuation of the system UI mods. I'm gonna click the 3 minute battery and status bar. Uh, do I want anything else? Let me look through this. Oh, remove carrier labels, that's interesting. And network traffic, hell yeah! Install weather mods and guys you can install whatever system tweaks you want to install. I'm just installing what the hell I want to install <laughs> All right, let's see what here. Let's do the colored nexus. I think that would look pretty wild. Oh Look it actually gives you an example of how it's gonna look <laughs> All right, so now we got some other mods and look at this it comes with Google Assistant. Just activate that just reading this, install with a reboot. Oh, we can do the add away as well. That is so cool. Add blocking as well. We got boot animation. <laughs> uh, install with a blue reset. Mm, let me see where the hell that is. Gonna mess with this as well. Now nah, let's skip that for now and just do the install Google. Okay, let's click all it. Let's click everything. <laughs> Getting confused here. It's so much so much features, man. All right, so I think that's about it. Just click on install right there. Alright, I'll be back when this installation is complete. It's gonna take a while. Uh huh. Okay, 70, 80, 100. Bloom! <laughs> Alright, once that's done, just simply click on next. Click on finish. Okay, let's see. Just swipe to unlock. And just another best practice just wipe Dalvik Cache one more time. And then you reboot the system. Alright nerds, I am back, but just an FYI, this ROM takes at least 15 minutes to install, so I just thought I'll inform everyone on that, and as you can see this ROM is butter smooth, zero lag with a very fast and seamless experience, you gotta love it, we got a way to reboot pre-built right in the ROM with recovery available just a fingertip away, man I am really digging and loving this ROM, we got Google Assistant right there pre-built as well, 
Man, this ROM is a beast so far. I'm actually going to be doing a full overview, a full review of this ROM, letting you guys know all of the pros and the cons, all of the perks, all of the flaws of this ROM. And guys, again, I can't stress it out enough. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And this is it. I am out. Have yourself an awesome day. And I love you guys. Peace.